hi guys actually welcome to my youtube channel my name is lynn gomane so guys i share business ideas that we can all relate to as south africans and today's business idea it is how you can start or open a mini movie theater in your uh, local community it can be your rural areas or your township so the reason why i'm focusing on these two is simply because they do not have access to cinemas or movie theaters so i'm thinking that if you can bring one into your community you can make money out of it so let's talk about today's uh, business idea now if you like the type of content that i create please do consider to subscribe hit the notification button so you'll be notified each and every time whenever i post a video so i'm just going to freestyle on this topic because it's just something that came into my mind out of nowhere so it's not like i have done some uh, intensive research on it so i'm just going to freestyle on it so now let's talk about the things that you are going to need for you to get started so the first thing that you are going to need you will need a room that it is not being used or a garage so it has to be an outside room right so okay if you do have one then you are good to go you will have to paint it using dark colors like uh, it can be dark gray dark brown or dark black so if you do have a ceiling paint the ceiling as well using those dark colors and then you need to make sure that you close your windows with something that will prevent the light from coming inside because remember we want to keep the room as dark as possible so that we can be able to get that cinema feeling after you've done all that now we can talk about the setting out you can buy um, cinema couches if you have money but if you don't have money you can buy the, the, the sleeper couches again if you don't let's talk about uh, the plastic chairs you can buy those cheap plastic chairs that cost for 65 friends each and then you can try by all means to decorate it and give it that gussy vibe if you cannot uh, afford to do that you can uh, uh, create your own furniture using pellets I've seen uh, people doing that so it is all up to you you need to make sure that you don't spend a lot of money out of it you need to save money okay you you just need to decorate it as well to make it look nice so that you can be able to attract uh, uh, a lot of customers after you've you've done your setting out now we can talk about the things that you are going to need in your cinema so let's first talk about uh, uh, your popcorns, uh, snacks, your soft drinks, and uh, it can be sweet. So whatever that you would like to offer your clients, you can buy that in bulk somewhere else and sell them uh, during the time whenever they are watching a movie. So you can try to offer some bowls whereby they can uh, use them whenever they are eating their popcorn or snacks and all that to avoid uh, the noise from there. Uh, when, whenever they are popping up their plastic from or, or of uh, the popcorns or the snacks and then now let's talk about the important things that you are going to need for you to get started like uh, like where you are going to get movies and all that so you will need um, a smart TV or a normal TV screen so if you cannot afford that you can always uh, go for a projector there is uh, some nice projectors in take a lot with good ratings i've seen them and they go for they start for i think from one point something uh, the one that i've seen it, it goes for 2600 trends and it has good ratings so you can go for that one if you cannot afford to buy a smart tv or a tv screen because remember when you buy some screen you will need to buy at least 55 inch or going up so that is that will be too expensive so you can uh, opt for a projector if done that now you will need to buy a laptop if you cannot afford to buy a laptop as well try by all means uh, that whenever you buy a projector 
buy the one that allows you to connect as a usb or um, a memory card on it so that you will uh, you will be able to actually just download movies uh, into your usb or into your memory card and just insert it and start using uh, the the projector so um what else are you going to need okay uh i think it's only that now where are you going to get your movies you can uh, you can subscribe on netflix or show max that is they've got nice movies there so you can i think the subscription starts from 100 runs uh, i mean 100 runs going up so I'm, I'm not sure because i haven't subscribed but you can subscribe on netflix they they've got like nice movies and new and series so that is what you can offer your clients or you can download uh, movies from soap today dot two i will leave uh, the, the 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 link on my bio so that uh, you can that is where you can actually download uh, the latest movies and just give you know the people from your township or from your uh, community that uh, movie theater feeling you know uh, you can start operating maybe around uh, 5 uh, up to maybe 10 p.m. or 9 p.m. It's all up to you because remember, we want to make sure that it is dark and they get to experience that uh, movie theater uh, feeling. So that is exactly what you can do. So I, I'm, I think maybe a garage can accommodate around 10 to 15 people. So... You can make over a thousand rand if you can charge each person by let's say maybe for like 20 rand per, per person and then again let's not forget that you are going to be selling your popcorns and all that so you can make uh with just uh, one session you can make maybe over six or seven hundred rand so if you've got like two sessions per day you can make over a thousand rand mostly on weekends because that is when uh, a lot of people are available and during the day you can try to offer you know the animation because there's a lot of kids so a lot of kids love animation so you can try to offer that you can make money i think uh, if you can do it right you can actually make a lot of money out of it uh, you just need to market your business well and please don't forget that you need a business plan so that you need to plan everything before you can even uh, buy a single thing for you to get started because remember you do not want to to regret as time progresses maybe you buy something uh, that is not going to work for example you buy a projector and you are not going to use it because people are not coming so you need to plan thank you for watching i will see you on the next video have a wonderful day goodbye